With pleasure, I introduce Nikesha Henry of the Nevis International Secondary School, recipient of a remarkable teen award in the category of environmentalism. Environmental protection, preservation, and cleanliness is the mantra governing the great works of this impressive young teen. Although Nikesha is of a quiet disposition, she is a brave and courageous activism powerhouse in defense of our land of beauty, St. Kitts and Nevis. Her passion for the environment runs so deep in her spirit that when she was younger, she would actually ask her mom to stop the car so that she could take up trash that was improperly disposed. When that request was not possible, Nikesha would organize a group and return to the site to remove the garbage. In 2019, she single-handedly launched an international petition on the importance of banning the use of single-use plastic bags. Youth Can is the name of Henry's own youth group, which has produced a video documenting historical sites in Nevis. Her group has coordinated a visit to the New River Reforestation Project and international coastal cleanups. Nikesha is, an, is on a mission to make St. Kitts and Nevis a plastic-free federation and stands ready to serve in any way to help St. Kitts and Nevis make the transition. May it please you, Mr. Speaker. Thank you, Dwayne. The Honorable Mark Brantley will, will present. Mr. Speaker, may it please you. I am overjoyed to have this opportunity to present this award to Nikesha Henry, a young woman from the heart of my own constituency and one whom I have come to know quite well. I have always been impressed with the passion that this young woman brings to anything that she does. And yes, we are recognizing her tonight for her incredible work on the environment, and in particular, her work to ban plastics and styrofoam, a work that I support wholeheartedly. The environment, clearly, we have to take care of it if we are to survive and if generations yet unborn are to have a world to live in. And young people like Nikesha are leading the way, and for this I think they ought to be commended. I am not sure whether she would like me to share this with us here in Parliament and with the nation and the world who are watching, but while she is being recognized for environmental work and her activism for the environment, I usually refer to her as Prime Minister because it is my fervent belief and I speak it into being tonight that one day Nikesha Henry will be the Prime Minister of St. Kitts and Nevis. Yeah. 